Look at this. There's 3,472 subscribers in my trading group and we're killing it daily. I want to give a few shout outs to my trading group. CBC, thank you so much. I'm up $13,000 this week. Your group's amazing. I made $47,000 in April because of your setups. You're, this person's up 2,400, 1,500, 647%. This person doubled my money after a phone call that we had、uh, just yesterday. This person said, I woke up and I had 73% gains in data. Thank you. I woke up with 58% gains while I was sleeping. Another $1,000. That's $4,000 in seven days. I've got a cryptocurrency trading group. I've got six chat groups where everybody's calling out breakouts, posts, and charts, working together to trade this market. I've got 41 videos in a playlist. If you don't know anything about trading at all, nothing, you can watch these videos. You'll be making profitable trades. Number one reason why people join my trading group is I post profitable trading setups every single day, and we've been killing it. If you guys want to join the cryptocurrency trading group, you want to pay in crypto, email me, cryptobitcoinchris at gmail.com. I'll get you set up and in the group today. You pay for six months in crypto, you get a 20% discount. You pay for the year in crypto, you get an additional month for free and a 30% discount. If you do want to pay with a card month to month on a monthly basis, you can do so. There's a Patreon link that's in the description. This is Tezos up 72%. You can see here's the setup posted. Here's 52% out of link. Again, bought the breakout down here. Here's the setup. Here's Ethereum, 57% gains out of Ethereum. Here's the setup. Bitcoin at cash broke out 60% gain to over time. I want to thank everybody for watching Crypto Revolution. We talk about everything crypto daily. If you came into cryptocurrency to make life changing money, to make so much money that you never have to work for anybody else again, subscribe to the channel. I'm going to keep you updated with the news that moves the markets, Bitcoin technical analysis, altcoin setups to make you profits. Jumping right into the market today in crypto, Bitcoin at 11,843. Bitcoin hasn't been doing a whole lot over the past few hours. However, there was this flash crash of a few hundred dollars we're going to talk about. Essentially, Bitcoin rent dropped from 11,900 all the way down to 11,421. And I'll explain why this happened.、It、had something to do with the CME gap. The gap boys are back. Also, remember there's a CME gap down here. What are we going to run down there and fill this? Boy, can't be scared about what Bitcoin's going to do, but it exists. So, Bitcoin's been in this rising wedge, which this is technically a bearish pattern 68% chance of a break to the downside. However, I'm going to show you later on in the video how when Bitcoin is trending higher, Bitcoin goes against the percentages and these do break out to the upside. Okay, so just know that there's parabolic moves when these do break higher, and that has to be considered. But as long as Bitcoin continues in this range, these altcoins will continue to take off. Bitcoin does nothing, altcoin season continues. Now, these large caps haven't taken off yet, but as Bitcoin continues to move higher, alt USDT pairs, the larger caps, will start to take off. And I'll talk about a scenario with Bitcoin dominance that can play out in the favor of the larger caps as well. If you're hit, sitting there holding some of these stale coins, I'm telling you, there's so much money. I had somebody hit me up and they said, I've got a, a, ba- a huge bag of Tron. Got a huge bag of Tron. I'm like, well, what's it doing? Are you making any money? No. Well, <laughs> pretty easy decision then when these altcoins are exploding 20, 30, 40, 50% in a day. Pretty, I mean, what do you think you should do? You don't want to steal them. You don't want, you want your money to work for you. You don't want it to be stale. Stale money does not make you money. I got some amazing shout outs in my trading group. Guy said, I jumped on Kava as soon as the video dropped, not even in the group. I made $1,000 in 40 minutes. I want to thank you from the bottom of my heart. Next person, you were the freaking man. I don't know about that, but I try. He said, I joined your group May the 4th, 2020. I quit my job June the 2nd. And I'm up over 85% since. I know I'll become a millionaire because of your videos and your groups. It's that easy. Next person, I've been using your strategy on one minute charts. I was using leverage. I'm not a big person as far as leverage goes, but, but people do trade on leverage in the trading group. I started with 2,500, he said. I lost 1,300. No surprise, leverage. Gambling. Then I had this aha moment, and you guys are going to have it too. When everything starts to click, and you realize that, hey, 
I want to be different than the herd. I'm going to think a little bit different. I'm going to take profits. I'm going to do things that other people aren't doing and I'm going to take their money. He had this aha moment and he said, I just crossed the $30,000 mark. Turned 2,500, lost half, turned it into 30,000. Next person, again, leverage. I went from $5,700 to 136,000 in five months with your group. Yes, I did it with margin. However, I wouldn't have known what to do without the videos and your charts. And that's exactly right. You can apply different ideas and different strategies, but the building blocks of everything starts with these videos. Next person, I joined the group two months ago. I'm up to $11,500. I started at $1,500. He 10 x his portfolio in two months and a week. If you want to make life-changing money in this market, I will help you and I will show you. We've got a long bull run coming. Ride this bull run with us. This is Anchor. Man, I've talked to you guys about Anchor so many times. Anchor, 90% profits in two days. So Anchor, you can see you have this big like cup and handle. Boom, goes through price discovery. It's huge explosive move to the upside, 90% gains. Right, so we saw band go through price discovery, chain link, you're up here and it's just free. It's like moon mission, right? You have to build some market structure. Really, you're trying to find the point at where the buyers and sellers can agree on a price and, and that becomes the next fair market value. And that's essentially what's happening here. CELR, I talked to you guys about this yesterday. I posted it and I covered it on YouTube and I said, hey, Binance staking is going to happen soon. This person saying, hey, it could 2x for sure. And then boom, 40% gains out of CELR. Also a good setup, kind of cup and handle-ish, but huge gains after this was covered. These rumors, boy, it doesn't take much. I remember 2017, you get a, a website redesign and you get a 25% pump because they're adding some stuff to the website, right? making it look a little bit nicer. Troy, up 25% today. Today was phenomenal. I can't even tell you how amazing it was. It's been such a crazy busy day. Okay, STX, here's a setup for you guys. There's a lot of news on this in August. You got mainnet, 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 September 31st. You don't have to be a day trader to make a ton of money in this market. You find some news, find a good technical pattern, rounded bottom here, buying the breakout. Here's your take profit levels. STX, here's all the news that STX has. Again, mainnet launch. They've got a rebrand crash course on August the 28th in about three weeks. They've got a data summit, a ton of ask me anythings where they've got to release some news and some hype, pump this price. There's a future proof conference as well where ZEC is involved. Remember, Blockstacks was one that kind of pulled the sheets over our eyes, had previously announced a mainnet launch and then they postponed it. So let's see if this they can keep this date, right? You wanna make sure that these projects hit these dates. Cody, how many times have we talked about Cody on this channel? The CEO came out and he says, look for this, and this is about a week ago. Look for the upcoming weeks of Cody. You can see your head's gonna spin. There's so many things coming. We got new merchants, we got credit card processing, blockchain dollars live release, Cody pay release, new fiat listing, Cody X release, and more. The blitz starts tomorrow. So again, this is about seven days ago. Here's Cody and Paywise. So they're introducing Paywise credit card processing. They've got about 100 merchants onboarded here. Again, this is about four hours ago. Got this news earlier today. So Cody, big news, right? You want these news. News is going to pump the price. Then you want to find a good setup. And I had a good setup. Let me get this out to you guys. Of course, power went out, raining. Fell asleep, took a nap. I was up early, making sure the group got a ton of gains in this amazing market. Had this set up for you guys. Buy the breakout of this level. Buy the breakout as soon as I post it in group. Moon mission, moon, moon mission. Here's the uh, <laughs> resistance level. It did break out. Ran up about 20% or so. It's like, you guys got to remember, we're buying Cody down here. Down here in the doldrums. Down here in the depths. Actually, before Cody even got listed on Binance, we were up like three or 400% while I was on KuCoin. And Cody actually has a lot of news coming over the course of this year still. So 
Again, obviously you don't wanna buy the top, you wanna to buy a retrace, but just putting Cody on your map. Remember on June the 19th, and I talked to you guys about this, posted it in a group, and I said, just wait until the masses figure out Cody is DeFi. Boom. Yeah, it's booming all right. You gotta think ahead, it's like chess. Think a couple moves ahead. Buy when nobody's talking about these coins, but know that this news is a catalyst for things to come. Like you, you planted seeds back in May and June, and now it's harvest season. These coins, man, harvest your gains. Yearn Finance got added to Binance, and, and YFI is has skyrocketed. Previously, it was up 11,000% at one point. In a week, in a week, it got to $4,000. And I said, you know what? Caution. When coins are first listed on Binance, they are extremely volatile. I normally wait until they settle down and immediately got listed 25 Bitcoin sell off. Right. So people took profits immediately. So price discovery, their supply and demand meet. OK, and that provides some stability and a price point. Once you get to that point, you can start drawing patterns and understand that you get some market structure in place to kind of trade these these cryptos and, and compound was added to binance and took off a lot of these get added to binance and take off just obviously you're not wanting to buy in blind there's it'd be nice to have see some type of market structure behind yearn finance troy i talked to you guys about troy troy was taking off today and, and had a pretty amazing day uh but they've got a, a good roadmap ahead i talked to you about this troy ecology before they're a Binance IO, like that's the magic thing right now. Think about these coins that were Binance IOs. Other ideas were Kava, Band, Fetch AI, ERD, CELR, which we just talked about. One, I need to get a chart on one. Check out one. There's some upside there. Pearl, Perlin, WinK, CTSI as well. So Troy has some news coming. Whiteboard this. Put this on your whiteboard. September the 30th brokerage software as a service platform coming now i showed this to the herd leader and he wasn't very happy he said i'm how am i missing out on these gains i said herd leader you need to get on binance bro this is where all the money's being made look at this 55 percent 41 percent 32 31 29 28 26 25 23 22 the herd sees nothing happening right now do not be the herd you're stuck on Coinbase, make a change. You want to make life-changing money, it starts from within. You might have the biggest opportunity of your lifetime right in front of you right now today, and you just have to jump. You just have to say, you know what? I may not know how to do it. I mean, dude, there's a YouTube channel. There's, there's YouTube videos on everything. Anybody that says, I don't know how to, I'm just thinking, good luck. Good luck at any kind of success in life. If you don't know how to, well, you know what? You can find out real quick. My best friend is Google, and I use it daily constantly i google everything listen make a step outside your comfort zone start trading these small cap altcoins now there's a link in the description for binance use binance it's got all the good coins it's got tons of liquidity it's the largest exchange by volume if you're in the united states you will have to use pure vpn so definitely sign up for that check out some of these small cap altcoins Here's NAV. So there's rumors that there's a couple pump groups that are going to pump this. I don't necessarily know how if that's true or not, but you do have a falling wedge here on NAV. It hasn't really done anything recently, hasn't really taken off, but again, something to watch where falling wedge, 68% chance that this does break higher at some point, right? Is there another leg down and then a break higher? That's the question. Bitcoin right now is in this rising wedge supposed to break to the downside however i can show you multiple multiple times where bitcoin breaks to the upside on these rising wedges okay so you can see here previously when bitcoin essentially was down around six thousand broke to the upside got this parabolic move to the upside all right then we go back uh this was when bitcoin ran up to fourteen thousand. okay you see you got this rising wedge rising channel right broke to the upside here again okay this is very similar market structure to where we're at now imagine if this is where we're at right here just at the base at the base and we'll run up to twenty thousand. boom moon mission okay back to 2017 
you can see multiple times Bitcoin broke to the upside. Here's the China dump. China says, hey, we're banning Bitcoin and cryptocurrencies. I was I was in, the, in a hotel in Florida on the ground. Families passed out sleeping 3 a.m. in the morning buying this dip. I the dip works fine in an uptrend. But boy, when you start buying these dips, it's, it's a waterfall effect. Buying the dips and downtrends not recommended so and bitcoin broke to the upside on these three occasions when bitcoin breaks higher out of these uh, rising wedges it's hard to bet against bitcoin okay you kind of have to ride with bitcoin bitcoin dominance right now bitcoin dominance has been slowly falling this has really helped a lot of the altcoins again larger caps haven't taken off yet you have to wonder if you're going to put in some type of double bottom right here and it reverses and that would slow the movement of the alt cap altcoins uh, down a little bit why did Bitcoin flash crash earlier today? I woke up and I'm just like, what the heck happened? Should never be surprised by a Bitcoin move. I mean, it was a 500 point drop, right? $500 drop. So right here, if you notice, there's, there's no, there is no candle. CME Bitcoin futures was closed. Okay, so this, what happens, the price dipped and fell down. See how this wick dropped down and it filled this level? Okay, fill that level. So there are open orders right here. So the idea is market makers that there, there's open orders. They want to make sure the orders get filled. The idea is a price action um, is manipulated to fill these gaps. Okay, but keep in mind, you got the CME gap down here, 9,600 and 9,900. Don't forget about this guy. Keep it on your radar. Have a plan in place. If Bitcoin breaks lower, what are you going to do? If it breaks higher, what are you going to do? How are you going to play? Do you have 40 altcoins? Are you going to have stop losses in place on all of them? If you have, do 40 coins, cryptocurrencies are like kids. If you got more than five of them, good luck. Good luck managing more than five coins. I can't do it. The fear and greed index is daunting. Right now, people are greedy, extreme greed. Bitcoin ran up to 14,000. This got up to 95. And, and it was just like Bitcoin is just pumping nonstop, right? At that point, the, the chances of a pullback are extremely high. However, the extreme greed, you do get Bitcoin pull, pullbacks when this happens. So just put that on your radar. This is Tezos. Tezos. I talked to you guys about this two days ago. Two days ago. Let's go over Tezos now. Boom. Boom. Moon mission. Okay. So this is a falling wedge, right? A break higher. If this can hold, and if you get, I mean, you got tons of volume coming in. You see this volume spike right here? All right. So if this can hold above this level, Possibly you get a retest and an explosive move to the upside. Here's your targets over here. Okay, just following up with that. This is Milk. MLK got listed on KuCoin. It's a blockchain loyalty platform. And it's a rewards platform, essentially. So it gets listed on KuCoin. They're super excited because, again, it's, it's, KuCoin is kind of like the training wheels for new projects. You know, it's not quite unibright. It's maybe a step above. It's obviously centralized as well. So, But the... Idea here is they have swappable loyalty points and they're basically exposing these to areas beyond Asia. So as the brand grows, more integrations with lifestyle, hospitality, leisure companies are expected to be announced. The project already has several major brands on board. Because it's listed on KuCoin, it's easier for people to pick it up. More liquidity, obviously more people can buy it. So South Korea's fastest growing online travel agency is Eventually working with this project, a popular retail outlet in downtown Seoul, Korea as well. So you can turn your rewards points into a currency and this can be traded for other reward points or even cash. So the project is tackling the problem of rewards points going to waste because customers are unable to spend them with the issuer. Milk, MLK is a ticker. This is the milk chart booming. Okay, so this is overbought right now so it's completely normal to think you'd see some type of pullback so if you if you are thinking about mlk picking up some milk we want to look for a pullback to a support level for this guy okay mlk kmd all right so i posted this in the trading group shortly hasn't broken out yet uh, so you can see kmd is moving in this range and it has been for an extended period of time so here it's at the bottom of the range now so you have to assume, obviously, it's going to move to the top of the range again. 
okay? But you, this is not, hey, buy now. This is buy the breakout of this level. And then here's your targets over here. Real quick, run through some news for you guys. Shanghai Gas moves into the second phase of their project with VeChain, VET, constantly in the news. Charles Hoskinson says, comes out and he says, hey, Ethereum Classic, I'm going to bail you out. We're gonna, I'm going to come help you. Ethereum Classic says, no, thank you. No, thank you. DeFi tokens ban link outpace Bitcoin price by gaining 100% in 10 days. DeFi, this market is, DeFi is booming quickly. IOTA revs its engines for mainnet upgrade launch. So their new mainnet upgrade launch is going to happen in about a week. And if you look at IOTA's chart, it's breaking out. Dang it. I can't post these set up fast enough. I post them in group and they're booming. So essentially, let's just adjust it for you guys by the breakout of this resistance level. Uh, this is already a midterm hold in USDT that I gave to you guys previously uh, so that you're in some profits right here. Uh, these are the targets over here. IOTA, again, put some news behind a nice rounded bottom and you might get an explosive move to the upside. This is a, a larger cap coin. It's heavier, okay? It takes a lot more money to move this, right? These huge gains that we've seen in a lot of these small caps, it's a lot harder for these large caps to see those type of gains. However, IOTA does have some news behind this. If you like the content that I provide on a daily basis, be sure to subscribe to the channel, like the video, comment below, hit the bell for notifications. Thanks so much, I'll see you guys tomorrow.